Hey, what's going on, folks? Another edition of Carolina Panthers talk. Without this being so much focused on the Carolina Panthers. Brought to you by Blitzball Champ Gaming. I'm Blitzball Champ Jason Ingram here on the U to the Two. So, this isn't really Carolina Panthers specific news story but i figured i'd go ahead and throw this in because i know a lot of people are going to be talking about it so i figured i'd go ahead and throw this in but the new england patriots have released quarterback cam newton and they will be starting rookie quarterback out of alabama mac jones now, I know, I'll be honest, I was surprised. I was very surprised. They also cut uh, quarterback Brian Hoyer as well. So, overall, I'll admit, I was very surprised. I honestly did not think Cam Newton would get cut. I honestly thought that he was going to start, but not so. It's a little bit of a bummer, but... It is what it is. Now, I've already been hearing from many people and just all around YouTube and such about the whole question and idea of if the opportunity was there, should the Carolina Panthers bring back Cam Newton? As much as I love Cam Newton, I mean, after all, he's a former MVP. He's played in a Super Bowl. Very gifted, very athletic quarterback. But I'm going to have to say no. I do not believe that he's coming back to Carolina, nor do I believe that Carolina should bring back Cam Newton, especially to play. Now, if it's to sign a contract and retire, sure, why not? Definitely. But to sign him to play this season, no, I would not do it. Some things that you got to think about. One, look at what happened. He got beat by Mac Jones. That says something. You know, it's nothing against Cam Newton, but Mac Jones won the starting job. I'm not going to look at the whole him not getting vaccinated as, as really something of, of focus on, because, I mean, you know, everybody has their choice. I guess some teams just will handle that specifically different from others. But not only that, you have to also think of you have to also think what has Cam Newton done lately? You know, what has he done lately? There's still going to be questions about his health. Not only that, getting him now and just to throw him in as the starter over Sam Darnold, which don't get me wrong, on paper, Cam Newton is definitely a much better quarterback than Sam Newton, or not Sam Newton, Sam Darnold. Cam Newton is a much better quarterback than Sam Darnold. There's no comparison whatsoever. But Carolina Panthers are invested in Sam Darnold. Their actions have shown that since getting Sam Darnold. And they are sticking to it so badly, being that they're not making an effort to go get Deshaun Watson, which the Texans have confirmed they're not going to be trading Deshaun Watson. So those that still have high hopes for that, I mean, y'all might as well let that go because it's not going to happen, especially not to us and especially not this season. 
if anything, I could see the Texans seeing what they have as far as picks and, you know, what's available and, you know, options and such and the off season after this season. But I really do not see Deshaun Watson being traded this season, nor do I see him being traded for the Carolina Panthers. So honestly, y'all might as well go ahead and let that dream go. Y'all might as well go ahead and let that dream go because I highly, highly doubt it. And I honestly don't think it's worth it. But anyway, back to Cam Newton. You know, I always love him as a player and for what he's done for the Carolina Panthers organization. But, you know, in all honesty, we really got to, we got to see what, what happens with, with Sam Darnold. I mean, the team has invested and him picked up his his extra option. They're going in on him. I mean, that's just the way it is. We just have to come to accept that. And just to get Cam Newton and just throw him in there as the, as the starter. Because, honestly, he's not going to want to be a backup. I highly doubt that he's even going to want to be a backup. Because that's where he would be. You know, coming to Carolina, hadn't played in this new system with the new coaches or anything. There's there's no way he would end up starting. And I highly doubt that he'd be willing to be a backup. So, that's just my honest thoughts on that. But, if you ask me where could I see him, where could I see Cam Newton going? I mean, shoot. <laughs> Mm. Maybe Washington. Maybe the Colts. I mean, the whole thing with Carson Wentz, you know, he's on the uh, reserve slash COVID list. I mean, and Carson Wentz, he's not one that's consistently been able to stay healthy. Cam Newton could compete for that starting spot. I was thinking the Bears personally, because honestly, I think he's a lot better than Andy Dalton, personally. But I mean, there was even thoughts of him going to the Dallas Cowboys and backing up Dak Prescott. But like I said, I don't really think he would be willing to be a backup. But I could see Washington or the Colts. I know I was talking to my, my brother recently, and he kind of was upset at hearing this because he would have rather, uh, he's, he's a Philadelphia Eagles fan, he would have rather gotten Cam Newton than having to trade and get uh, Gardner Minshew, you know, which he's now on the Philadelphia Eagles. But I don't know. Those are just some teams I was thinking of that might be a good fit for or Cam Newton. But as far as a Carolina Panther homecoming, don't see it happening. Don't see it at all. But anyway, let me know what y'all's thoughts are. How do y'all feel about the New England Patriots releasing Cam Newton? Where do you think he will go next? Or do you think he's done for good? Or do you really, really want to take that chance? And if it were you, would you actually bring him back to Carolina? But anyway, like, comment, subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you don't miss a video. Thank you so much for watching. This is another edition of Carolina Panthers Talk. Coming at you here on the U to the Tube. I'm your host, Blitzball champ, Jason Ingram. Hope everybody has a blessed day. See y'all soon. Laters.